This is the 22nd running of the Festival of Speed at Goodwood and Mercedes-Benz has been there since the start. It's great to be back here because we have an opportunity to show the latest, greatest new cars on our main AMG stand, but also to celebrate the 120 years history we have in motorsport with some spectacular displays of old cars driven in incredible style. We're talking about addicted to winning at Goodwood. Is there a better feeling? The further back you come from to get to the win, that's actually the best feeling when you actually feel like you've really gone someplace, you've, you've outsmarted other people. in front of the house just looks awesome. The way it does kind of bridge that, that motorsport heritage quite literally, it's taking something that spans a huge amount of time, a huge amount of passion that's gone into 120 years of motorsport. And for my small part, I, I think that, that reflects it very, very well indeed. It's the first sculpture that's gone over Goodwood House. Uh, you catch glimpses of it as you drive into Goodwood. And I love that, just seeing it towering over everything. something really special to be in Goodwood. If you want to see uh, this collection of cars, you have to come to Germany to our museum or you have to come here. Being here with the atmosphere is terrific and, and it's just amazing to me that people will come in masses like this just to enjoy what was the old days really. Driving a car like this, it's such an unusual car. It's, it's a car that very few people get the opportunity to drive and just enjoy it. It's exciting that people feel so enthusiastic about it. Well, I think we were all crazy about cars and we wanted to create something that would bring everyone together and you know, be very authentic. And it's now the biggest car car event in the world, so it's, it's a bizarre thing here. It's one of the greatest looking racing cars ever made, so it's an enormous privilege and a huge treat to be in it now. It was obviously a brilliant experience and have Sterling you know, having trouble keeping up with me was obviously good too.